What's going on guys? Welcome to our brand new series. This is going to be replacing Pokemon Glaze. This is a ROM hack of Pokemon Soul Silver. Everything uh, Pokemon is owned by the Pokemon Company, so um, hopefully they don't take this down or anything like that. But basically this is Pokemon Storm Silver. Um, as we're going through this, I'll actually explain why we're doing Soul Silver instead of Glazed. But basically, um, as I was playing through Glazed, I was I basically had recorded at least quite a few weeks worth of uh, episodes, and the next day I go to record a little more. The save file wasn't there, like there was no save, and I saved it like three times before closing it. And mind you, the game did say it saved, so. I don't know what's going on there, but anyways. Sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to Sacred Gold or Storm Silver. A hack with an expansion of features. My name is Professor Oak. But everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor. Before we go any further, I'd like to tell you a few things you should know. Let me show you a native Pokemon. Oops. The Johto and Kanto regions were known for having only a fraction of the Pokemon within its borders, but large-scale migrations has brought a great variety to the region's fauna. There are new challenges awaiting you, and a great amount of differences in how you'll raise your Pokemon. Now, why don't you tell me a little bit about yourself? Are you a boy or are you a girl? Why don't you please tell me? So you're a boy then. Please tell me your name. But yeah, <clears throat> this is just gonna be a regular Soul Sil uh, Storm Silver um, let's play because of the fact that oh, that's what that does. Um, I, I was I was planning just to do a regular let's play of of uh, glaze, so that's what we're gonna do here. Is at least have at least a regular let's play. Rampage, are you ready? Your very own tale of grand adventures is about to unfold. Let's go to the world of Pokemon. I'll see you later. If you ever want to find out some of the changes, check the documents that should have come with your game. Most, if not all, information you need should be contained in there somewhere. But play as you like, for you might enjoy playing the unknown. Either way, be sure to have fun. Alright, so... Let's check. Oh. Read? Okay, I guess that's all that's in there. Anyways, yeah, we, we chose... Actually, not we. I, I chose Storm Silver because um, I did just do Crystal. But I wanted to do something that has a little more uh, story added to it on the second generation now. So, we'll try this. About time you woke up. Professor Elm wants to see you. Here's your things. I hear Johto has changed a lot in the last few years. You should be careful, Rampage. Here, take your running shoes along. You'll probably want your bike music player as well, Rampage. Nice, we got a bicycle already. I'm guessing that allows us to have the original music. I'm sure you know how to use these. I hear Elm has a gift for you. Thank you for no tutorials. Now, I'm gonna actually click it so I don't have to um, constantly keep clicking it. Um, let's change our frame, obviously. The question is to what? You yep, know, let's go that. Oops, I didn't press confirm. They actually have a lot of them in here. There. Let's 
it's gonna be Lyra. Alright, so let's go up here for a second. Is there anything special up here? So they basically moved their place up to here. In the original Gold and Silver, they had a house down in the actual town. So I'm actually curious if someone else is living there now. You like my bag? Okay. Yeah, because of Pichu, right? Oops. <laughs> so this is Liar's place. Let's go to see Lyra for a second. She's here. Oh. She's got an Azumarill too? No, I haven't gone to his lab yet. Yeah, is that her actual Azumarill, or is that her parents? Either way. So this is Professor Oak. Oh, I forgot to read his per first book. Oh, hey! I got an email! Um... <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hey, listen. I know a person named Mr. Pokemon who finds all sorts of crazy stuff. He says he has something, but we're so busy with our research. Can you pick it up for us? You can take one of the Pokemon in the machine. Okay. Ah, uh, I can't back up. You know what? This is just... I'm literally gonna... Have to go on the uh, what's it called? I'm, I'm literally just gonna close my eyes and actually I'm gonna mute the sound real quick, and I am going to randomly pick my starter. Just hopefully you guys believe me when I actually choose it. So we're gonna have to go with that. Right now, you guys can probably see what I'm getting, but I'm still moving around, probably. This is one we're going to pick right here. Oh, so we ended up with Totodile, and I don't know why I didn't actually click anywhere else. Anyways. But I did pick it. What the heck? So, we ended up with Totodile. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll go with nicknames for the, at least the team. Uh, I'm gonna go with my usual, um, for alligator name. I don't know if anybody actually knows this reference, but... This is actually from the uh, Peter Pan movies, even the live-action ones. Yeah, I, I, I don't remember if it's an alligator or a crocodile, but its name was TikTok because of the sounds he can make with his eyes and stuff like that. How do you like walking with your Pokemon? It's not bad, is it? You can take it all the way to Professor po to Mr. Pokemon's house. If your Pokemon gets hurt, you should heal it with this machine. It's so easy to use, just check the, the PC on my desk. Mr. Pokemon goes everywhere and finds rarities. His house is past Cherry Grove City. Go north a little past the Cherry Grove. I'm counting on you, Rampage. Okay. Uh, I want you to have these to help you with your task, in case you've got potions. 
Okay, don't hesitate <laughs> to use them, I guess. Uh, there's Lyra. Rampage, you got yourself a Pokemon. Gotta say, it's really cute. When you walk with it, it'll become more friendly. You should turn around and talk to it sometimes, too. Oh, that's right. Why don't you show it to your mom? See you. Yeah, let's go talk to her and see what she says. <laughs> that's what happens when you have running shoes. You tend to walk into walls. Uh, let's see. Do you end up giving us anything else? Yeah, we got the Poke Gear. Okay. Yes, I remember. That's pretty much the same. They always have that same dialogue, I guess. Wait one second. I almost completely forgot about this. Here, I'll give you my number. I'll call you if anything comes up. Okay. We're just gonna train up a little bit. Maybe one or two levels. Let's see what kind of Pokemon can be found in here. I guess the usual. Wait, did they remove? Yeah, they did remove the tree here, so we can just take the shortcut over this way. Can I pick up the Apricorn? Nope. I really should have talked to everybody on the route. Because you never know when someone's going to give you something, especially in these kinds of games. It's nice that they made starters learn their, at least a good move, pretty early on. I had to use my first potion. I just found a potion. What do you know? Oh, I can find Starly here. Nice. Glitchiness. <laughs> but that's normal in this in this game, I believe, isn't it? All right, so let's. Okay, so we can find Spiro here as well. And Geo Dude as well. I really should move around the moves, I think. Anyway, uh, let's get get to Cherry Grove then, I guess, right? We can also find Pidgeys in this grass, too. Oh yeah, this guy. I don't know what he actually gives, but... We got an old rod. Okay. I wonder.
I really should stop speeding things up, shouldn't I? Let's see how toted that feels. He's dizzy, so maybe we should take him to the Pokemon Center. There we go. Anybody up here? Nope, just that training center. Okay, so let's head over up. Oh, that's right, he gives you the town map. So it gives you the Apricorn box, which now we can actually start collecting these things if we wanted to. It's dope. So now we gotta head up this way, I believe. Hey, this isn't, isn't that Cynthia from Gen 4? Oh, hello. M Mr. Pokemon said he was expecting you, a young trainer to arrive. Is your name Rampage by any chance? I see. I guess you are the trainer Mr. Pokemon was expecting. My name is Cynthia. I'm a, I'm a Pokemon trainer who hails from Sinnoh. Tell me, Rampage, have you heard a story that tells the tale of the legendary trainer? You haven't. I'll briefly explain the story. The story tells the tale of how a trainer travels the land of Johto and Kanto, catching all the Pokémon known to mankind. He captures the most basic of Pokémon and even the most mythical of Pokémon too. Eventually, come face to face with the one who the Pokémon call God. The archaeology of the Johto region appears to back the existence of this story. It's interesting, to be sure. Thank you for listening to me, Rampage. You know, you remind me of a trainer I knew from Sinnoh. You may not know it yet, but I think you're capable of great things. In fact, I'd like you to, ha to help you reach your maximum potential. Here, let me give you a small gift. Receive the Eevee. Would you like to give the Eevee a nickname? Because I am planning to evolve this into a Umbreon, so we are going to name it Luna. It's a guy, so why would we call it Luna? Uh, I know. Lunar. Numerous possibilities of the evolutions for Eevee and Eevee make a very interesting Pokemon. I wonder what you'll decide to evolve Eevee into. Perhaps we'll cross paths again, Rampage, but until then, farewell. Let's actually have a look at this Eevee. It's level 5. The only attack and move it knows is Tackle. Well, let's get some training to Lunar. Okay, so I'm going to just skip through this because we're just getting the Pokedex from Professor Oak and also talking to Mr. Pokemon about the Pokemon egg. Oh. Hello. Hello, Rampage. It's a disaster. Um, it, It's just terrible. What should I do? Um, oh no. Please, get back here now. 
Well, before we even head towards there, we're going to end it off right here. So if you guys are excited for this series, even though it's replacing uh, Pokemon Glazed, hopefully you guys will like this a little better. So if you do, please be sure to stomp the heck out of that like button, leave a comment, and also subscribe. And I'll see you guys in episode two.